The second witness in the Zandile Kometa fraud and corruption trial, Sean Hitler, will continue on the stand this morning at the Durban Court, rather the Durban High Court. Hitler is the person who first processed the anonymous information allegedly handed over to the municipal's investigating unit back in 2018. Gumete and her 21 co-accused face a string of charges relating to the awarding of a Durban solid waste tender with over 300 million rand. ENCA's Desen Thalthia is covering that story for us and joins us with the very latest. Good morning, Desen. So Mr. Hitler continues on the stand today. Perhaps give us a summation of what we heard yesterday. That's right, uh, Sean Hitler on the stand yet again. You know that he's with the city's integrity and investigations unit. And his testimony has been particularly important because he's been, he, he was the first person that really handled that complaint that was received by that office in 2018. So as you can imagine, after his evidence in chief, the defense has been trying to find out how that process thereafter was handled. So most of yesterday was taken up with advocate Jay Naidu for Zandide Kumede cross-examining Hitler and really trying to understand what he did after receiving that complaint. So the basis of that cross-examination from, from what we could tell during the course of yesterday was that Naidu was trying to essentially poke holes in Hitler's version of what he did. So simply put, what Naidu is saying is that there were internal mechanisms that could have been used to handle this complaint, but were they used and why weren't they used? Instead, you know that ultimately this investigation was outsourced. It was sent to IFS, which was one of the service providers to the Etagwini municipality. There are 17 of them in total. So largely over the past few days, that's what Naidu has been hammering on about. He's been trying to find fault. And yesterday, they brought in another case file. This was the case file that included a common accused. So an accused in this matter and uh, someone that features in that other investigation as well. So Hitler told the court that that was the reason why he handed that docket over to the team that was already investigating the other matter because he saw a commonality there. But before the, the day ended, the lawyer for the former city manager, Sipo Nzuza, also stepped in for cross-examination. Griffiths Madoncella started yesterday, and he's expected to continue his cross-examination of Sean Hitler this morning. All right, Desson, we'll leave it there for now and catch up with you as the day progresses. That's senior reporter Desson Falfia, who continues to monitor that solid waste tender trial that's continuing in the Durban High Court.